um, the labels that are on all of our chemicals. The labels um, have... We have quality control meetings. We have safety meetings. We have a safety committee that meets once a month. We make sure that the plant is safe. As you all know, we are very concerned with safety here at our company. We're concerned with hearing safety, that you wear your hearing protection whenever you're in the production or um, tumbling areas of our plant, that you wear your safety goggles whenever they're required, and that we keep a generally clean plant because the cleaner plant we have, the safer plant we have. The worker's safety is a very, very important element. We, we work hard you know, towards that goal. We have a good safety record. Well, safety is our number one priority. The bottom line is, metal forming is people. Skilled craftspeople balancing their vision of tomorrow with old-fashioned values. We have a responsibility to our people to challenge them, to educate and train them, to offer a workplace that is safe and clean, to provide opportunities for people who care about what they do, to give them a chance to grow. People are the most important thing. You can buy new technology and you can buy uh, new equipment and you can install new methods, but unless you have people to carry out all these wonderful plans, uh, you don't have a business. There's a lot of people involved in making the parts. The shipping department is important because we make sure those parts get to the clients when they need them. I'm working for the company 10 years now. I came to Cleveland Saturday, and I find this job Monday. And I'm still working here. Well, the future seems great. They keep growing more and more every day. More jobs. The company's getting bigger. More people. And I love it. I really enjoy the work because each job you presented to you is a new challenge and nothing is, no, no two parts are the same. You're constantly being challenged on a, a variety of levels. I like my work. I can come in every day as a nine to five job and work without looking at the clock one time. It goes by so fast because I'm, I like what I'm doing very much. Um, I'm having fun and making money at the same time. <laughs> it's an excellent field. It's a never ending field of learning. Every day I come in I learn something new from our um, from other employees or just by sitting down reading through books. It's a good future, a good, good place to work, and a good field. If you have the ability and the, and the drive and the knowledge, there's no telling how far you can go in this, in this field. There's lots of room for um, the talents of women in this industry. Um, there are women out in our shop as well as um, in, in the office here. I find it very exciting to work here. Um, they really promote a creative atmosphere. Uh, they enjoy input, suggestions. I like that. I don't feel stifled at all. When you're working at a manufacturer, you are building, say, planes, stuff for the government, and a lot of big, big companies depend on you. But I, I like when I go on trips, I'll see a Boeing jet, and I'll say, hey, you know, we do parts for them. It's, it's a nice feeling. We make parts that go onto spacecraft for people like JPL, and they go throughout the universe. And it's thrilling, because you know you are a part of something that is making history. A responsibility to people, and also to the environment within which we live and work. Preserving the environment, a key issue in the metal forming community. We use gas heat, we don't pollute the atmosphere. As a matter of fact, the material that we use, the metals that we use, are all recyclable and are used over and over again and do not become part of polluting our great country. The future, I feel, is uh, very bright. We see more and more manufacturing and uh, coming back to the United States, we find we're getting more and more opportunities throughout the world. Uh, we can be competitive in the world market, and that's something that really excites us. The Precision Metal Forming Association is an organization that helps its members by monitoring the regulatory climate in Washington, 
charting the winds of technological change, anticipating the needs of tomorrow, responding today. It's an international trade association there to educate, train, and protect its members, helping them to carry out their primary mission, to provide the public with the world's greatest products. We've uh, been able to, to produce, through the trade association, set up training courses that will allow us to uh, upgrade an individual's skill to a very uniform level and uh, with, with regard to the uh, press setup work. And then from there, they can uh, they progress much more rapidly to other positions. Our biggest handle on change for our company has been the uh, Precision Metal Forming Association. I believe it's been a strong uh, stimulation to our success of our business. It's hard, almost impossible, to imagine a day without metal forming. A vast yet unseen industry using a variety of technologies to produce the parts and components, however large or small, which empower humanity. The machines, devices, conveyances, appliances, and electronics we depend on at home, at work, and in transit. The products we take for granted all day, every day. An industry of precision machines and high-tech and people. Craftspeople dedicated to manufacturing to raising the quality of our lives. Metal forming, indeed, is a part of our lives.